Oh, and by the way, I love this vest, the Milwaukee M12 uh, heated vest. This thing is seriously awesome. I wear this underneath. Uh, I wear this underneath my jackets because it's thin enough to where you could actually do that, and it seriously keeps me warm. If I don't feel like wearing a, a hoodie or a heavier jacket, and I don't feel like wearing uh, a jacket, and I just wear this over a hood, over a, a sweater. Gotta love BCG. Alrighty, today what we are gonna do is we are gonna look at the $50 Packout Hold Dozer Kit. When I saw this kit, I had to get it. $50 for all this stuff. We'll go through really quick on what is inside, but this stuff is selling out. These are gone at my Home Depot already. They were gone within the first four days of the actual sale. So I was lucky to get one. Before we get started with this, I wanna give two shout outs. One to VCG Construction. Go check them out. They are an extremely good watch, very informable. And uh, also I wanna give a huge shout out to a new tool channel that I just recently discovered. All right, so for the second YouTube channel, I wanna give a huge shout out to is Shop Tool Reviews. This guy is a good watch. The, he, I love his impact driver and impact wrench test. You know, the test he has set up is the test I wanted to build like months ago. And he actually, he actually has the torque, uh, the torque gun to where you can actually set the, the nut or bolt to a certain foot pounds at a high foot pound torque, which that, that that's like a $4,000 uh, torque drill which that is seriously awesome that he has it. I wanted to get that a long time ago, but I, I can't afford $4,000 on a tool. But check him out, Shop Tool Reviews, fantastic channel. Both VZG Construction and Shop Tool Reviews are in the description below. Check them out, they are both, they both are a good watch. All right, but let's open this up, let's check this out, and let's see what's actually inside here. All right, so of course you get the pack out unit. So this thing is seriously awesome. This unit itself with nothing inside besides uh, I think uh, five little containers that, that can set in there. <coughs> this goes for I think 30 bucks alone. Put those back in their spot. All right, so first you get five hold dozer units in here. You know, these are seriously awesome. I use hold dozer in my my videos all the time. I got the three inch right here. All right, but this kit comes with a two inch, a two and a half inch, a two and a quarter inch, a one and a half inch, and a two and five eighths inch. So that is the whole dozer units. These things are awesome. All right, so and of course you get the, the actual uh, guide unit, the driver unit for the holdover kits. All right, so it is very easy to put these on. All you gotta do is take this, the, there's threads right there. Just drive, the, just uh, put that in, then you take the, the rods, you insert the rods in place, doesn't matter which set. Then you take the nut, and there you go and you are good to go. Now, if you wanted to change this out, you just undo that, lift that up, undo that. It's a good locking feature, I like that. Now, if you wanted to change the, the drill head out, all you had to do is go to the Allen key that's right here, see if I could focus in on that. The Allen right there. Then you just un undo it, that should be good. Take the drill, the drill head out. Of course you can adjust that to wherever you think you need it. Right there is good for me. Lock that back in place. Then you're still good to go. Let's put the two and five eighths on there. There we go. Put the nut down. And there you go. That is ready to go. Now I 
that is ready to go. Now, obviously, you cannot put this into an impact driver, but you could put that into uh, a drill. So for the blades, zoom out a little bit, this is what you get. You get four metal, and darn it, there we go. All right, so you get a total of nine metal blades. Uh, four of them are six inch, and they have 14 teeth per inch. And you get another six inch, and this has 16, uh, sorry, 18, yeah, 18 teeth per inch. And you get five of those, and then you get wood with nails. You get four of those blades, six inch and five teeth per inch. So that, that so that's not bad. So uh, the fifty dollars for all this that that's absolutely insane. And so like I said, I would uh, hit these up if I were you. These are really good blades. I love Milwaukee blades. I vouch for the I vouch for the hold dozers because like I said, I've already used the three inch hold dozer a lot, as you can tell by the burn marks and the wear and tear of the teeth and the paint gone. And so yeah, I seriously uh, suggest you get this, but we are going to use these. I do want to use a two and five eighths hold dozer on this, in this video, and we're going to test each of these blades out, one of each. So we're going to do a six inch by 14 teeth, uh, six inch by 18 teeth, and for wooden nails, a six inch by five uh, teeth per inch. Remember when you work, wear gloves and safety glasses. Got mine right here. Alrighty, so we will be using the Milwaukee M12 fuel hammer drill for this. Oh, oh, oh. I didn't crack my screen. Battery is full. It's on speed two. It's on drill. And that does fit in there. Now, I'm not sure if you guys ever heard of this, but click this back one to lock it in place. Just listen. All right, right here is good. All right, so ready? Go. Time. Time, time, time. See, Milwaukee hole dozers are awesome. That's why I use them. That's why I use them in my videos. Time. I got the Super Sawzall. We are going to use orbital and non orbital. So, ready? Up, we'll use. Regular first. All right, ready? Go. Time. That is a beast. That is a beast. All right, now we're going to use orbital. All right, ready? Go. Time. Okay, next, let's do a single one inch black steel. Simple stuff in this episode. We're not doing anything hardcore. Let's see if there's a difference between 14 teeth and six or 18 teeth per inch. All right, so ready? Go. Oh. Yep. A battery would help. Perfect. All right, so ready? Go. All right, then the last one, the 18 teeth per inch. Right here is good. All right, so ready, go. Time. All right, so as you can see, the Milwaukee hold dozers and the recent blades are actually extremely good. So this kit, for $50 is unbelievable. All right, so if your Home Depot still has these, I'd pick one up immediately. If you just so happen to be at Home Depot while you're watching this video, buy it. Because I was told 
by uh, the guys at my Home Depot that once these are gone, they are gone. They are not being replenished. There are no more coming. So whatever your store has, that's what it's going to keep. And so, yeah, so I picked this up at a good time. I'm glad I was able to. And it is totally worth $50, especially for the packout unit. That's absolutely insane. And, of course, they, they are, Milwaukee is majorly doing uh, specialty items in their packout units. It's not just a box anymore. Now they're actually already coming in kits like this. They've been doing that for a while, especially for their socket sets, but they're making more than just this now. They're making complete custom kits that you can uh, buy with this packout unit and the bigger ones, which is seriously, seriously awesome. All right, so just like you guys know, I have, I have more videos coming up. I have the Milwaukee M12 fuel oscillating tool. I'm gonna do a hardcore stress test on this motor and I wanna see how long this battery would actually last inside. I have the Milwaukee oscillating bits or attachments, if you will. And I also got the DeWalt Bluetooth uh, headphones because uh, I've, I always wanted a Bluetooth headset. I always like this band that goes around your neck because you, it's, th these are hard to lose. I have a huge, uh, I lose things a lot. So this one is way better than the little ear uh, ear pods that you could put in your ear, either the real Apple or fake ones. I lose stuff. I lose my ring a lot. and. Luckily, I find it. So this unit would be better for me, so I won't lose it. More videos coming up, and like I said, please check out VCG Construction. Check out Shop Tool Reviews. Some of them are seriously fantastic channels, and so, so that's pretty much it. If you found this video helpful and entertaining, please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos, and please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.